Uh, hey there, Fred. Hey, Bonnie! Hey there, Shooting Guy here. Thank you so much for joining me today. I do appreciate it a lot. You had a choice of thousands upon millions of YouTube channels to rest upon, and you stopped by here. And for that, I'm very grateful. And those of you that have uh, subscribed, thanks so much. Those of you that aren't subscribed and just kind of swing by occasionally, why don't you think about subscribing? It would really help us out a lot, and I do appreciate it if you would. And uh, just as a reminder to you all, we do have a, a, a web page. We got a whole bunch of stuff going on there. We got a Facebook, we got an Instagram, we got a Snapchat, we got a Twitter, we got a bunch of things. Check them all out. I'll put links down below and you can see all that. Fred Light is the thing that I want to talk about today. It's the Flashing Roadside Emergency Disc. That's what Fred stands for. It's by Wagon Tech. Uh, Justin, our buddy out there at Wagon Tech, sent us one of these. And uh, we thought we'd uh, give it a whirl and uh, take a look at all the stuff that it can do. And uh, it looks like it's, a, it's a, an electronic road flare is what it is. And we're going to run it through its paces. For right now, I'm going to take my trusty Korean butter knife that's been turned into a very sharp blade. Check out the YouTube link that I have down below. I'll put a link there and you can see how we got that thing nice and sharp. But right now, I'm just going to cut through it and... Well, I guess it doesn't work. Yeah, it does. Sure, why not? kind of works. I'm gonna... Boy, okay. So this is good for cutting paper, not cutting through plastic. Now I know. Wh what am I gonna do? <clears throat> I don't know. We'll work it out. There you go. Scissors. That's what I'm gonna use. I'll just trim right around here, and then hopefully I won't mess up the uh, uh, instructions on the inside or any of that. Yeah, this is by far easier. Sometimes, you know, knives are not the best tool to use. Uh, and a cheap old $2 pair of scissors from Dollar Store. Well, I guess then it would have been a dollar pair of scissors. Um, work out. There it is! It's my Fred! Okay, before we go much further, let's get to the specs! Its diameter is just about four inches. It's about an inch and a quarter thick. With batteries installed, it's six ounces! Take the screws out, push on these little guys. There you go. And it comes with batteries! There are 15 LEDs, three here, and 12 all the way around. Do the math. It's shatterproof. <laughs> Survive. It's IP55 rated. What does that mean? Dustproof and waterproof. Watch. Look at that. It floats. It floats. It's a floaty. But submerging water. Let's see if it works then. Uh, it won't sink. There you go. It floats. And it lights up the water. Nice. Yeah, it works. It's safe and it won't start a fire like a regular flare. But can be seen just as easily. It's simple to turn it on. You push it till it clicks and then it starts going. To turn it off, you push it hard until it clicks again and it's off. It's got nine lighting modes and one LED work light mode. So remember, you push it down hard to click and then you have your first mode, which is a three LED flashlight last six hours. Just shine the light up underneath the truck if you need to. To go to the next mode, don't push it so hard to click, you just lightly touch it. And it goes to the next mode. Double blink for nine hours. Do it again, it's double pulse for nine hours. Single blink, 38 hours. Rotate, nine hours. This one's a lot of fun. You're being arrested. I told you this one's pretty cool. Alternating for nine hours. SOS help in Morse code for 15 hours. Solid on high five hours. Pretty bright. Like I said, that can be seen from far away. So it's further away. Yeah, you can kind of see it out there. Not bad. Solid on low 28 hours. Even in the low LED mode, it can be seen pretty good. And a two LED red flashlight, nine hours. Nice strong magnet for when you need to stick it to a metal car. Ooh, look at that. Nice. And this hook comes in handy when you just gotta hang it around and you don't have any metal to stick it to. Oh, there you go. Perf, look at that. Yeah, Fred, <laughs> he's quite handy. Yeah, if you need a light of any kind of sort for emergency use or 
just using it as a flashlight or working around the truck or something, you know, throw this into your car, into your truck in an emergency, it'll be very valuable. That's what I say. Anyways, if uh, you know anything about this and you have one yourself, uh, let us know down in the comment section down below. If you don't, I'm going to also put a link down there so you can go to Wagon Tech and buy yourself one. They're about $14 or so. Not too bad for all the, uh, the features that it has and the ability to uh, light the way in the ways that it can with those 10 modes that it's got all total. Very, very cool. LED is going to last forever. Very durable. Waterproof. Hang it, stick it. Batteries already come with it. It's ready to go. Nice little package. That's it. All right. Thanks for joining me today, guys. I do appreciate it a lot. If uh, you haven't subscribed, pull that subscribe button right now. All right? Thank you so much. We'll see you next time. God bless you. God bless America. And may America bless God. Hey, thanks, Wagon Tech. Let me show you one of the cool features. Because it's rechargeable, all you got to do is drop the thing. Am I still recording? I guess I am. Hi, 220 loom. Uh, it's got three. Here we go. It's got a built in USB recharging cable. I.e., that went the wrong way. Mm -hmm.